I noticed that you just had a little bit of a giggle at this. <laughs> I didn't notice until I was at 7-Eleven the other day and I saw the, uh, you know, the security monitors and I looked up and I realised I'm thinning. <laughs> Yeah. I am, I'm thinning, I'm fully thinning, and I'm thinning back. out, right on the, top. At the back or...? It's not going to grow back, it's gone. <laughs> like, you're lucky you're married. <laughs> oh. Anyway. Welcome to Hot Seats. This is the episode where it's funny how seriously we take our racing. And Sam, we're talking about the big one, the Tab Everest. Big mountain, big race. Exactly. Yes. Mate, $6.2 million to the winner. $15 million in total prize money. There is a reason they call the Tab Everest the richest race on turf. Who are your two favourite jockeys? Stop it. Yep, that's right. Please welcome James McDonald and Karen McAvoy. Oh! There. <laughs> boys, boys. Right. come in, take a seat. COVID safe. <laughs> All right, beauty. This is actually distance just because Sam is a massive fan and he is a toucher, so... Uh, hey! <laughs> good it. it is the biggest time of year for you guys as jockeys. Oh, definitely, yeah. It's uh, time of year to be winning races, that's for sure. We've got the big checks out there, the big dollar races, and, um, yeah, it's a great time of year, that's for sure. Tab Everest. Now, you've won twice. You're on the second favourite Classic. Classic legend. And you are obviously on Tab's horse, Nature Strip. At what point do you guys get real competitive and start not looking at each other? I think he'd throw me a bone from time to time. He's won two of them. He's won everything in Australia. <laughs> We're on talking terms, but might be half an hour before the race might be a different story. I'll be that far in front, it won't matter. <laughs> oh, there you go, Nature Strip. Is there something that you guys do before a race that you always do? I've got a, a lucky necklace that I wear when I ride. I don't wear it any other days except for when I race rides. If I wear a new suit to the races, and if I don't ride a winner, I don't wear it ever again. Oh, really? Oh, wow. And that's <laughs> that's expensive. Straight in the bin. Yeah. How many professional jockeys are there, like, in Australia at the moment? Near up to 600-odd, yeah. You never see jockeys in the wild, you know what I mean? Like, I, I, <laughs> is that a short joke? Is that because you can't... Is that no, because they're I'm little? just saying, I ne I've never... I've... Seriously, on, on behalf of all Shetland people, I'm offended. <laughs> Absolutely offended. There was a guy at the front and he was taking beer bottles out of, my, out of our yellow bin. Anyway, the guy was, you know, he looked a bit dodgy, he was dirty and scruffy and... A bit like you, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go on. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm riveted. As I shut the door, he goes, are you a jockey? It was a bit weird, I actually got spotted as a yeah. jockey. Oh, Mind you, by, by a hobo in a bin, <laughs> so you know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, boys, thanks very much for your time. Best of luck at, at the Tab Everest. Tab Everest, guys. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck. All right, well, it wouldn't be uh, right to end the episode about the Tab Everest without getting a tip. Sam, who's your tip? Look, as much as I don't really know stuff, I am going to sit on the nature strip, uh, much like the emotional hard rubbish that I am in my life. That's a good call. Uh, tabs runner, nature strip. You know what? I'm going to have to agree with you there, Sam. Let's yeah. hope Classique Legend comes in second. Classique. Uh, all right, that's all the time we've got. We'd love to hear who you're backing in the Tab Everest, so leave your tip in the comment below. Or tag a mate, or, uh, and also ring your dad while you're at it. He's lonely. Good idea. <laughs> Before we go, we probably should check in to see how our donations to Prostate Cancer Foundation of Australia are going. Look at that, Sam. Well, that is a beautiful number. Let's keep those shares going and keep that climbing higher. We'll chat to you next week on Hot Seats when we're talking everything fashion and football. Ooh. Talk to you then. Bye. You guys have to keep your weight down for race days. Do you have to worry about what you're eating during the week? Just like, say, if I was just to rip out a whole chicken. You are on a diet right now. I'm okay. very rude of you. Mm. How'd that go for you, mate? Not really good. I thought it would be a lot funnier, but that's okay. That's... <laughs>